Hello my good friends, happy Saturday and welcome to episode 26 of Patreon Picks. Nice and straightforward these clears, uh, message me at any point, let me know what games you want me to do. Uh, arcade games work better but I've got I've got a massive list of games to do so if there's games you want to see me do like this then yeah drop me a line if uh, you good Patreon folk love to get involved with these things uh, game needs to be realistically doable in less than 90 minutes but I mean it's arcade games I mean if you it's very rare unless you're on some kind of marathon run they lasted longer than that and uh, pocket money rule so 14 credits max which is two quid a week back in old money uh, which is how much you used to get uh, Thank you very much to each and every one of you if you support with One Credit Classics and Patreon. Um, I, uh, I'm i like way over halfway to that computer. I mean, it's probably going to be, it'll be the summer I would have thought when I end up picking it up. I'm dead excited, dead, dead, dead excited. Um, don't forget to check the Amazon affiliate scheme at the bottom. If you shop there, use the link where you get a percentage, it won't cost you anything. And there's a PayPal link as well, as well which is paypal.me forward slash One Credit Classics. Um, and all proceeds go towards uh yeah the new pc uh so yeah i'm oh, it's i keep seeing like video footage of it and shots of it and it's like it's so ostentatious to buy like a gaming pc to play old games but i really need a new pc anyway and i'm ready to embrace the embrace the technology but uh but yeah on a today's uh on a today's today's fun game aren't you a little young for contact aren't you a little old for video games i mean let's be honest i'm neither uh, but if you recognize that bit of dialogue from 1988's Bloodsport, then you'll recognize this gem, Karate Champ from Data East. Now, this came out originally in 1984, and it was everywhere. And it's one of those games that whenever you see, like, films about that took place in the 80s and people walked in arcades, or if you walked in an arcade in the 80s, you could tell if they had a Karate Champ machine from the second you heard the door, because you just heard that full point. It was, like, one of the first games that, that, uh, that had, not that, that had speech, but had speech that just seemed to just permeate and stand out over everything else um the control system was unique it featured a dual stick setup um which is nicely emulated on the buffalo as if you remember the buffalo usb pad it's got snare style buttons that fit in a cross so you can replicate the second stick on the buttons and do the pad for the first one um and yeah i love this game and i was so psyched when it showed up in my messages to that somebody else wanted to have a look at it as well which is so cool um so what i'm going to do it never ends uh, but i'll try and i'll have a couple of goes because oh, i just fucking love this um and also, finally, if you do get the chance, uh, obviously Bloodsport, uh, which is the Jean-Claude Van Damme, uh, Bolo Young film from 98, uh, was based around the li life and times of uh, Frank Dukes. Um, and what a fucking charlatan. If you look into if you look into him, it's unbelievable. The absolute bollocks that he came out with, that he was in the CIA, and that uh, him and Van Damme had written a film, but he'd lost the audio agreement of it in an earthquake. And that uh, he held the... the his story was that he'd been invited to a, a no rules kind of kumite like which is what blood sport was about um in in uh hawaii i think he said it was or, so, or somewhere somewhere exotic anyway um uh and he'd been uh, invited there in the 70s and he won the whole thing and he gave him a trophy and like all the stories are that he just fucking bought a trophy and he won 56 and i saw like the maths for it it was something like he won 56 consecutive bouts by knockout which would mean the bracket size would have to be like, for you to win a tournament and win 56 bouts, there'd have to be like 4 billion people in it or something. So it's stupid like that. It's just, uh, oh yeah, it's just ridiculous. But yeah, that is, uh, yeah, Frank Dukes, check him out. It's like D-U-X. Um, it's just absolute, absolute martial arts charlatan, of which there seemed to be a lot more back then. But anyhow, um, yeah, Karate Champ's awesome. So let's get going, shall we? Let's do this, shall we? Beautiful, straight in the gym. Beginner? No, I assume that means you've never fought before. But this is cool. It'll give you a chance to get used to the controls. So it'll give you some thingies and you'll see you'll get a few more points if you actually do them. I did that wrong, obviously. Nice. I do like the bat round kick. That was wrong as well. Nice, that's cheeky. No. Bollocks. Oh, beautiful. Absolutely dipped him. Come on. What did I get for that? Half point, really? Oh, I'm going to team up with that. Get that. I've gone in like a right dickhead here, aren't I? Sparring dead heavy. Oh, 
Oh, I got full point for that. Was very good. Right, let's have a look. Rubbish. <laughs> I'm so shit at that bonus. It's still, bonus rounds are basically undoable. Get that. I'll teach you to chuck. Half point for that, really. I'll teach you to chuck a fucking flower pot at me, you dickhead. Oh, you didn't like that, did you? Oh, come on. Oh, this geese is getting absolutely worked. Oh, Jesus. What do you get half for that? I, I still don't get that. I'm going to get him back one, though. Oh, cut, I mean, levels. Was good. Hey, up. Bang. Why not? I mean, do you know what I mean? You've sparred twice. Let's go for the Nationals. And this is basically, not where it ends, but it loops indefinitely on this. You just try and set a score. Get that. What did I get for that? Full point for that. Solid. Makes sense, really. Oh, I do like that front kick. Nice cheeky fake there. Oh, come on. I mean, that was beautiful. What have I got to do now? See, I'm shit at this. You've got to try. I never know which attack to dig you with. You better give me a full point for that. I was going to say. Oh, no. Old school karate block. Didn't block that one, did you? Dropped. Fucking stopped and dropped. I mean... <laughs> this is some high-level concussive shit. I don't... A punch I need for this, right? That's not it. The beautiful, a little too advanced, clearly. I mean, he was still ducking at that point. That would have got him straight in the head. Hey! Oh, fucking hell! Bollocks. I mean, only a half point for that. You shit me, aren't you? The old faithful front kick. Again, fucking body snatcher. I am in this. Oh, what's he get for the cheeky? <laughs> only a half point for a sweep. Yeah, it is. No one's ready for that. That was rubbish. <laughs> that face. Come on. That's just fucking beautiful. Dual front power punch. No. Dueling sweeps there, mate. I mean, these people are just getting absolutely rinsed by me here. Oh, fucking hell. No. Fucking rubbish. Right. I don't know how that works. Full point for it, I'll take that. Ugh. 
can't stop. Sp I can't keep just keep spamming that jump kick. Come on. Pff, no one's ready for that. No one's ready for that fucking tape straight to the ribs. I only need one more. There you go, bang. Just fucking gee, geezer comes in range. Right. Rubbish. I'm so shit at that. I don't know what to tell you. That's my fucking move, that front kick is. One for that, surely. Full point. It's got to be. And I score as well. Come on, you fucking idiot. Foot sweep as I was going. Come on. Look at that. I mean, that was beautiful. I can't... I can't... <laughs> I can't... Right, I'm going to get it this time. Come on. Bollocks. At least I sort of know what I'm doing. What are we now? Fifth. I guess I assume this guy's going to be a bit harder. Nope. Well, harder, but I mean... You, you sink anyone in the body, they ain't going to want to know, are they? Oh, Jesus. What's that one? Full... Yeah, I suppose. It's a bit bollocks, but... Nice. Old faithful. Got to be careful here, though. Oh. Jesus Christ, that is. Oh, God, I'm... If he whips me now, I'm out. But I've got to try... Oh, fuck it, I'm going to try and... Fuck. That's got to be full point, right? Come on. That was like the end of Karate Kid or something. <laughs> oh. Some points. Me and you again, son. Get that. <laughs> Straight out, fucking drill him to the body. Full. Only half point for that. Oh, yeah, that was nice in all fairness. I bet he gets one point for that. No, he gets half. Good. I was going to say, it's fucking load of shit otherwise. Oh. I mean, I didn't even set that up. Surely people are watching tape at me at this point. I've come steaming in with the same three moves. It's a load of front kicks to the body. Right. I'm fucking going to time this right and get this. Come on. No. Fuck off. That's so hard. Oh, Jesus. That was decent in all fairness. Come on. Nice. That flight, like, it all depends on that first, how it, where he goes for that first move. Shit. What what does he get for that? Half point. Yeah, I would have think so. He punched me in the back of the head. Get that. What do I do I get a full for that? No, just half. Oh, what a load of shit. On the buzzer he beat me on that. What an absolute heartbreaker that is. That's a great run, though. I'd have another go, but I'm not going to play it anywhere near as good as that. And that run had everything apart from me getting the ball. And that, my good friends, is it. It's correct. That was a, that's probably the best run I've ever done. I'm made up about that. So, yeah, so that was that. Um, I don't know. It's just fun, isn't it? 
I said this about all these games, but every time somebody pulls out a Patreon game, it's like there's so many suggestions out there that I'm just really, uh, I'm really psyched every time I, uh, every time I pull one out and it's something like this. Um, this game's awesome and it's an awesome part of kind of a. Uh, See, so yeah, I didn't get that right. Of that 80s arcade culture. When you heard, like, fall point all across the thing of the arcade, you knew what you were getting into, do you know what I mean? You just knew that it was going to be awesome. And I don't know, it's just, it's a classic bit of 80s arcade culture and it's it's everything that One Credit Classics is about, really. Well, not punching people in the kidneys, but, I mean, this run had everything, to be honest with you. Apart, like you say, apart from the bonus round, it had, like, it had loads of dead close finishes and a load of awesome matches, so, so yeah. It just keeps going on and on and on. You can get like the rank of like grandmaster if you win enough matches. I think it was seven. I think we got to six Dan, didn't we? I think it was like seventh, eighth, ninth, and then master, and then that just it just keeps looping. Then you get the same bonus rounds. Um, but yeah, that's it. Uh, that was that. I'm gonna go now and um, go to training. I would have thought it's Saturday morning. Um, thanks to uh, everybody this week who's got involved with the channel. Uh, the Jeff Capes video quite funny. Uh, a lot of people really into that, which is cool. Uh, what the hell's this? Amazing. Um, that's quite funny, actually. Uh, ironically, that they what's it? I hope they sowed the seeds for like with this. Sowed the seeds for like YouTube, really. And those karate instructional fails that I just spend all my time watching. Fantastic, um, and yeah, and if you do get time, go on to Google and put in Frank Dukes and see what an absolute bullshit merchant that he was, and the fact that he wasn't uh, in the CIA. Do you know what I mean? That he didn't write uh, a film, have the audio contract for it with John Claude Van Damme, destroyed an earthquake, didn't come up with a, do you know what I mean? A martial arts system, wasn't trained by a bloke that he made up that just happened to be the name of a, a, a karate master in a James Bond film, and. Uh, didn't knock 56 people out on the bounce in an underground like no rules tournament um so yeah full of shit um but that said uh, this game's awesome so it doesn't really matter take good care of yourselves have a great saturday and i'll see you good people on wednesday for oh, what else another episode of one credit classics what else take care